everyone. Thank you so much for checking out Crafty Little Rosebud here on YouTube. Tonight I have a very decent sized haul for you all. So um, definitely uh, grab yourself a drink or a snack and I will try to jump right into this. But first, check out the description below. Links to all of these shops will be down there as well as, well as any referral codes or discounts that I currently have access to and links to my social media. Um, I will go ahead and mention I'm currently doing PR for Megan Renee Plans. That discount code is down there if you are interested in her shop and getting a discount there. So let's go ahead, I'll get right into it. I am going to go ahead and start with the Sticker Guru subscription, just so I've kind of knocked that one out. And then I will just go through this very nice little stack here that I've got. So first of all is Sticker Guru. Um, I am part of their monthly subscription. It is a very affordable, nice price subscription where you get a cute little monthly kit and then additional little freebies generally from other shops. So the little freebies that I got are um, this one here from Plan2 Design. Um, Nostalgic Dreams Paper Co. I really like the little drink tea there. And of course, habit trackers, always useful. Um, planning Geek Designs, and this one's kind of different. This is actually like a whole washi banner without having to cut up the washi and make it yourself. And then the actual kit itself from Sticker Guru is for November. And so you've got your very fall oriented washi strips here. And then you've got your little um, icons all through here, your date dots. And then you've got the rest of your um, washi for your monthly. Um, Thanksgiving, Black Friday, Daylight Saving, and Veterans Day are your holidays to note. Right here, it's got little things, just so you know. And you've got the rest of your date dots, some really thin washi, and then some paydays here. And then you get a little mini monthly calendar and some full boxes, some check boxes, and then some little small boxes at the top and build due. So that is all that comes in that. Um, you do get different samplers from different shops and different things like that each month. And like I said, it's a very, very affordable subscription if you like getting a monthly kit and you like extra little freebies. So there is that. And then um, the next shop that we will get into is going to be um, Create With Pen. She does not do oops bags very often, but she did have some posted, so I went ahead and picked one up. And then of course she had some little Halloween stickers released, so I grabbed those as well. So for the actual stickers I picked, um, I got these cute little Halloween doodles here. So you've got a little witch, a little angel, candy, little cross spiders, and then you've got little um, ghost, a pumpkin, a little devil. So very Halloween-ish. And then you always get a little card and it is blank on the back. So you can use that however you wish. And then as for, for bleh, if I could talk, that would be awesome. As far as the um, oops go, I did not pick any of these. This is just what was put in there. So in here, let's see what we got. So it looks like it was labeled oops twice. I'm not sure if she started with smaller ones and then made some bigger ones or how that worked. So we'll go ahead and we'll do this part first and then I'll dive into those. So we got little Happy Mail ones and they look cut just fine. The color looks great so I'm not sure what was wrong with them. But I got those. We got little Recycle ones. A little sampler here. Again, they all look cut very well to me. And then we've got some little die cuts. I still don't know what to do with the die cuts, but I got some and they're cute. Don't know what I'm gonna do with them, but they're cute. 
And then um, it looks like we got this full sheet here and this is birthday collab, September 2017. So very cute. You've got little drinking coffee and bobo tea, is that what it's called? Never had it. Um, you've got eating cake. Um, let's see, looking over the computer. This is definitely me and my daughter. Um, <laughs> And then you've got a um, little Tinta and a little character holding a pencil and a little baby it looks like. So very cute. And then as far as the rest of the oops, cute little sticker right there. Um, let's see what we got. So as far as the rest, we got these little doctors or nurses. Um, I like to use these for noting doctor's appointments. We've got work script, little oops stickers, like oops, I bought too many. And I already have a sheet of this, but it's definitely good to get another sheet. Um, I heart EC, and then little cute rainbow ones. So that's all that I got from Create With Pen. Um, like I said, it was an oops bag. She doesn't do those very often, so I was very excited to check that out and see what I would get. Let's get those put away and then um, we will go to the next shop. And I'm trying not to take too long on each individual shop um, because I did order so much. So this is actually one, an order I won during the TPC um, sale giveaway. It is from the Modest Cat and I was very excited to get this. She was phenomenal. I actually even requested a sticker and she made it in time for me to get it before the end of the sale. So happiness packed inside, Bella the Modest Cat, and you've got your cute little cat paper. I'll salvage it the best I can. It's a very good seal. Um, so and inside, oh it's just like a cute little present, I love it. So back here it says, thank you for being lovely, for supporting my artwork and shop, for making a difference in our lives. The Modest Cat is a completely hand-drawn shop created by me, Bella. Mr. Modest Cat helps with printing, packing, and mailing your orders. We truly hope you love everything in this packet. Um, and then you, they're on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. I'll definitely have to check out the YouTube. I didn't know they were on there. So there is that. And as for my actual order, look at this. This is so sweet for Sharon. And it's got the little pumpkin cat. I almost don't even want to open it. I feel like I should stop and take a picture for Instagram. Okay, so I'm going to open it. Yes, I had to stop and take a picture for Instagram. It was just too cute not to. Definitely gonna hang on to this. Maybe I'll put it in one of my tea ends. So let's get into the package. Like I said, I really don't wanna open it. I, I mean, I am perfectly fine with all the other packaging, but the care that went into wrapping this is just phenomenal. Oh, we've got little, little confettis that are going to end up in my daughter's mouth. Um, and look, these are really cute. You've got these little cat Happy Mail confettis. I'll definitely keep those. And they've got some little stars and stuff. But let's get some of that out of the way because I do have a 19 month old that will potentially try to eat it. Or my cat will try to eat it. Someone will end up eating the confettis if I let them. All right, and it's even in a little Halloween um, baggie here. So let's open this up. Okay, and here, uh, Loomis. So a little Harry Potter oriented um, thing. Uh, thank you, love the modest cat. Cute goodies for Sharon. Again, all the customization. And then it looks like we got a little squirrel die cut. A little ghost die cut, and you know what? We're gonna reuse the little baggie she gave me and put all the little die cuts in there because I don't want to lose them. A little pumpkin die cut, and like I said, all of this was.
pretty much completely free to me. I think I may have paid shipping, um, but that was about it. So above and beyond. Um, so we've got this cute little freebie here. You are magic, TMC mail, happy mail, a little cupcake, a little candy corn, happy Halloween. And then of course their social media there cute little pumpkins and those are on like a glossy paper um, and then it looks like I got a shop freebie here so cheerful planner girl decorate by candy costumes this is a duplicate for me I believe and then TPC exclusive over 20 so we've got some cute little full boxes here and some little bars there little cupcake and then these are the items I actually ordered I got these little, <coughs> excuse me, I got these cute little fall leaves here and they're little banners. Um, this is actually, she asked for suggestions on Halloween stickers and I said minions and she threw one in there. Absolutely adore it. So you've got your little minion, your little fairy, unicorn. Um, like a robot, Frankenstein, a pumpkin, a ghost, a wizard, and a little ballerina. And like I said, she was doing these up during the sale, which is phenomenal to me. Um, let's go ahead and pull this out. So you've got Mallow is the name of her little cat, um, playing with little leaves for the fall. And then um, eating ice cream. My daughter loves ice cream, so I thought that would be good to have. These, I just thought they were all so cute, and she did full sheets of, like, all of these, but I couldn't pick, so I just went ahead and got the sheet with a little bit of all. Got the little meh, or patiently waiting. And then I asked for, like, Mommy and Me kind of stickers, and she drew these up during the sale as well. So this is Mallow and Millie, and I am obsessed these will be perfect for all the like mommy daughter things that I do with my little girl. Then little Christmas tree mallow. Little happy mail or waiting for mail, which I feel like I'm always doing. And then um, she had these watercolor flower girls and they actually had all the different skin tones and all the different hair colors. Um, I think even like a unicorn or rainbow. So they were really pretty and I went ahead and just grabbed what I thought would match me best. Although I debated on getting the rainbow hair. And then these cute little banners here. I thought these would be great for next summer. They're little ice cream oriented ones. I got the little fall characters. I loved the little squirrel. So I went ahead and got the sheet with all the little fall things. And then I went ahead and got the little girl playing in the leaves. I love the fall and I figure if I ever get around to raking leaves, maybe I'll take my daughter out to play in them. So that is everything that I got, which is plenty. I could end the haul right here, but I do still have some more to get into. Um, but definitely check out the Modest Cat. She was great with um, doing kind of custom things. You know, like I said, I requested the Minion. She got it done within that weekend. And then I requested the Mommy and Me and she got that done as well. So phenomenal customer service in my opinion. All right, moving along. We are nearing the end, sort of. So I did get my order from Sweet Bean Plans. I am in a continuous state of having orders come in from her. Um, I feel like every time I get an order in, I've already placed another order. So you will see Sweet Bean Plans continue to show up in my hauls because I'm just obsessed. She always gets me with her freebies and her $2 Tuesdays. So it's a never ending cycle. So here was the freebie for this time around. This is based on Mean Girls. Um, I like the movie, but I'm not obsessed. But she is currently obsessed with these little um, tiered, I guess she calls them like coffee trays. And so she's got all sorts of designs, sorry, just hit the camera, um, coming out oriented around these little coffee trays. And of course, I've ordered some, so you will see them in the future. You will continue to see them. So here is her Mean Girls based one. You've got your burn book, your little fruity drink, cool mom, fetch. And 
And then this is her Halloween postcard. I think she had different designs. Either way, excited to get any of them. So I got this one here. So then I got this cute little freebie here and it is very Thanksgiving oriented. So we've got Halloween and Thanksgiving going on. Um, I believe it says, oh, gather food, eat. This might even be a sneak of a kit she has coming. And then you've got the little bean character over here picking out and little fox on his shirt, a fall candle, pumpkin spice. Very cute for fall, Thanksgiving. It works for both. And then here is a Halloween one. I don't know if the cat has a name or not, but I really like it. It says Paranormal Cativity. And then you've got little pumpkin, a little fall banner, cute little Disney oriented pumpkin there. And then these are what I actually ordered. Um, they're not freebies. So here is um, this cute little bean with the pencils. My classes are about to start, so I thought that would be cute in my planner. Maybe note assignments. And then I got these little um, planner ones. So holding the tea in there, I'm starting to like TNs a little bit more, the more I mess with mine. And then I've got bean there with like their TN and washi and scissors and kind of working on setting up the planner. So that's for that sheet. And then we've got like a grumpy cat with bills because no one likes bills. And um, I just thought it was cute. Maybe it'll make paying bills a little bit more tolerable. And then this is Beanerella. This was a $2 Tuesday. And so I grabbed it in both horizontal and vertical. It is foiled and the lighting is not gonna be on my side today, but it is rose gold. And so I did grab two sheets because I loved it so much. It says, a dream is a wish your heart makes. And you've got your cute little desk here. You've got your pumpkin. You've got Beanerella. You've got a little unicorn, a cat, a pumpkin, your glass slipper, and another pumpkin. And like I said, I did get horizontal and vertical because I loved it so much. And then I also went ahead and got the washi strips that go with it. These work great for the horizontal and you get your date covers and some little strips here and then your little weekly box. And then I've been eyeballing this so I did go ahead and pick it up. It's kind of a card, it's not kind of, it is a card stock. Um, I got the hollow foil and it's just bean looking up at the stars. So that is all that I got from Sweet Bean Plans. Um, Hopefully I will get into my tan a little bit more so I can start using these postcards or dashboards a little bit more, but we'll see. I'm trying. I just, I struggle with it. I think the more inspiration I see from others, the more I'll get into it. Next, I got my order from Plush Paperies in. Um, like I said, I got a lot in. So here is the packaging on that and I will try to dive into that. My allergies are acting up a little bit, so excuse me if I kind of have to pause. Um, I'm trying to get through it. So I did place a decent size order, Plush Papery, I think had a sale, I'm not sure, I can't remember. Um, but I love micro kits, and when I saw that they had micro kits, I uh, definitely indulged a little bit. So here we've got another card, Always Believe in Yourself, and then um, Planner Boss Collective Sales, so I guess that's when I purchased. Um, Love Yourself First. And it looks like I got a little sampler pack. I'll go through that as soon as I go through what I actually purchased. So like I said, I went through and grabbed a bunch of micro kits. So I've got this one here. It's kind of like a relaxing lazy day one. Honestly, this is all I need for a week. Um, make, your ma make your own magic. So it's kind of like a Disney themed one. We're not going to Disney anytime soon, but I thought it was really cute and it was a great price, if I do recall. Um, this one, it was magical or everlasting or something like that, but I really like this deco. And um, I've seen it in a lot of kits and I figured for the price, since I liked it, go ahead and grab it. 
So you got your four full boxes here. You've got some typography and some little icons. And of course, boxes. And then I got this spell book one. I've already planned for all of October, but I figured I would set this aside for next year. You've kind of got your crystals here and like your bookshelf with all your like, I guess, spell books and then your like potion looking kind of stuff there. Let's see. What does that say? Morning pumpkin is what the cup says. And so again, I just grabbed lots of mini or micro kits. I really like the deco in these. I had seen them in other shops and the price for these was just great for what I would want to use or what I would be willing to spend. So um, her eyes sparkle because she sees magic everywhere. Again, I love the fox, the girl, the deco. For me, it was the deco um, in the boxes that got me with every single one of these. And then we've got like a little fall planner here, little fall setup. And these, this one actually makes me think of sweet bean plans a lot. Um, it just, I don't know, it's similar to some of the stuff she does. Um, it's the most wonderful time of the year. I'm not sure I'll use this one for Christmas in my planner, but if I don't, I'll have it for next year. I really liked the deco again. And I actually have this exact same pair of like socks. I guess they're socks. Socks for around the house. And then another kind of winter one. Um, this one, I, living in Kentucky, I could use it during January or February even, possibly even March, depending on how the weather goes this year. And then this one is Christmas. Not 100% sure I'll use it this Christmas, we'll see, but I really liked it. So we've got Merry and Bright. I thought the girl was beautiful, the flowers were beautiful, and I thought the little gift was really cute. So that is all that I purchased. Um, I will go through the freebies that I got. I actually didn't even expect to get freebies, so that's always a nice little bonus. Again, the allergies excuse my voice cutting in and out a little bit. So here, this is from Abby Marie Plans. Very vibrant Halloween. Um, Sassy Apple Studio. I've gotten freebies from them before. It looks like they've changed them up some. Very cute. I really like the wind down one. Um, let's see. Fab Planner Print, the adorable little girl with rainbow hair. I'm gonna have to check them out. I like this girl a lot. Um, Aurora and Avalon Creations. I've looked at their shop before, but I've never purchased. They have beautiful, beautiful artwork. Um, even though I've never purchased, I highly suggest checking them out. Uh, release all that no longer serves, the, yeah. Release all that that no longer serves you. Again, it looks very Halloween oriented. Um, 472 in Maine, Ohana time plan, time to clean. Seriously, put up your laundry. I need a dozen of these. I'm so bad about putting up laundry. Um, Katie Sticker Company. It looks like we've got some just little boxes there and then some script over here. And then Samantha May Sticks, love her. And so I'm really excited to get these. These will be great little headers, or if I want, I can turn them like this and use them as checklist. So those are the freebies I got that I had no idea I was getting from Plush Paperies. If I can get these put up, we will go through our last shop. And of course, I've got little confettis laying around. Okay, so the last shop that I have tonight is Perfect Prince Co. They had um, Misfits bags, and I think that's all I got, but I can't remember. Um, this order actually came in a little bit ago, and I just kind of set it aside because I didn't have enough to haul. Okay, you know what? I did order one thing um, besides Misfits. 
So let me show you the freebies first. Um, you've got this little, it feels like it's a sticker. I think it's a full sticker. When black cats prowl and pumpkins gleam, may luck be yours on Halloween. And it feels like it is a sticker, but I'm not gonna try to peel it up right now. And then this feels like, um, kind of feels like a sticker too, but I don't know. I'll have to mess with it. Sometimes they're die cuts, sometimes, sometimes they're stickers. Um, Perfect Prince Co. And then you've got your TPC stars, TPC ends, uh, Facebook Live, and then some cute little decos here. And the cat is cut out, FYI. All right. And then I did actually order one thing besides the uh, Misfits. I did order this Christmas. I believe I got it in a B6. Um, not sure if I'll actually use it in my B6. Um, but I thought it was cute and I really liked these little deco boxes. We will see if I use those or not. They say holly jolly and this Christmas sweater is what really got me. I just thought it was adorable. And then of course you've got your to do's today's this week meals to buy to go uh, to do little icons. <clears throat> Some little bow strips down here. Um, plan laundry bill do various size boxes checklist. So I just thought it was cute and I guess I liked the price. Then I grabbed a foil misfit bag. So we will go through that. This means I completely had no choice whatsoever in the color of the foil or what the design I was getting was, but I have always liked their misfit bags. They have never disappointed me, so I figured I was safe to go ahead and get one. So here I got these beautiful silver foiled bows, and these will be perfect for Christmas. I love silver foiling. Love rose gold the most, but uh, silver is right up there behind it. I've got some full boxes, and these are the clear overlays. I've gotten these before and they are completely clear here, so you just lay them over something. Let's see, this is rose gold, which I love, and these are little thin headers. Again, more rose gold, definitely winning with this, and these are full boxes. And then some more silver. So this is absolutely perfect. It's my favorite colors. And these are full boxes as well. So very happy with that. And I think those bows are just gonna be so pretty. I mean, look at them. They're gonna be perfect for Christmas. Cause I know I'm not gonna order anything that has gold on it. I might do rose gold, but I won't do gold. So the silver will be perfect. Um, and then, um, I grabbed just one of the regular Misfit bags. I can't remember how they list them, but it's some kind of regular foil, or non-foiled, sorry. Um, so here is our little weekly box, um, some little full boxes, and it's got these pretty water watercolors. See if I can continue to speak. Um, here is like a um, grayscale sampler, it looked like and then um, floral littles, and I really love florals, so these are just stunning to me down here on the bottom. And these are um, some smaller boxes, but that's fine. And then you've got your little to buy, to go, meals to clean, um, today to do littles, and then your little icons here, so very functional page there. And it looks like they paired some of the kits together, uh, some of the misfit pages from the same kits, which is really nice. Um, so you've got your full check boxes here and then some little boxes on the bottom. Let's see, up, up and away fun. So we've got some little flags here and some check boxes and some full boxes. Again, I can use these with other things, but it looks like they did an amazing job at combining some of the misfits with other parts of the kit. Um, so here we've got today to do littles, next week, this week meals, goals to clean, to buy, to go, and some little icons. This could almost go with this as well with the greens. Um, December labels, so here is a page of labels, and these are kind of glossy, I'll have to use Sharpies with it, but that's perfectly fine. I always keep Sharpies because I like using them on my dashboards. 
and then a dentist appointment. I really like this. I just started taking my daughter to the dentist. So now I will have mine and hers to track. So these will be very useful. And I never complain about a good functional sticker. Now this one says Galaxy Fun. So let's see, maybe there's more. I love Galaxy things. So um, we've got Payday, Lazy Day, Binge Watch Netflix, Don't Forget. We've got our boxes down here, some Habit Trackers flags, little Bill Do's and some Heart Checklist. And there's really not much wrong with this looking at it. So fine with me. Oh, this is so cute. So happy birthday, washi. And I love washi strips. So these are cute little birthday washi strips. And then you've got some smaller little strips cut out here. And you've got date covers and date dots. And it looks like the happy birthday continues. And that's the rest of the packaging. So you've got your little happy birthday stuff down here. And these are cut into smaller boxes or you can keep them together to make a full box. And then you've got your littles with um, all your words here, your headers, and then your little items here and then littles to do in today. And then you've got your ombre checklist. So I really like that they kept a lot of pieces of kits together. It makes it easier on me to use them down the road. And then the ones that aren't pieced together, you know, like this one here, I can use with anything green or any other color that goes with green. So I always love getting Perfect Print Co's, um, Perfect Prints Co, their um, grab bags or their misfit bags. They're always great. So I highly suggest it. So that's all I've got for you tonight. Thank you for sticking around with me through that much longer than usual haul. I hope you saw some goodies and definitely check out the description below for the links to these shops that I showed tonight. So thank you so much for watching. Bye.